Good morning. Good afternoon. Uh, good evening, family. Oh, boy. Welcome, welcome, welcome to the mental house with me. Your host, Khadija. Um, I got to, I had to come on here this morning because I'm really disturbed by um, some information that I just received. And it's concerning, um, man, so crazy. Actually, it's con um, Pernell, Sweet Pea, Whitaker. And from what I'm understanding is he got hit by a car uh, in Virginia. And um, he was killed. It wasn't a hit and run driver. It wasn't a hit and run. And Pernell uh, died at the scene in Virginia Beach. Now, what really happened is so sad. Man. Oh, my God. Sweet Pea, y'all know? See, a lot of y'all don't even know who Floyd May. Uh, y'all talking about Floyd Mayweather? Who you really need to be checking for and looking at is a uh, Sweet Pea, Pernell Whitaker, one of the greatest, damn, lightweight, junior lightweight. I think he fought middleweight. I don't know if he went up to welterweight, but um, God, Norfolk native and Olympic boxing gold medalist. Pernell Sweet P. Whitaker was hit and killed at a busy intersection um, in Virginia Beach. The accident occurred just after 10 p.m. on Sunday at the intersection of Northampton Boulevard and Baker Road. Officers arrived and found Whitaker had been hit by a car. He died at the scene. They said he was in pretty bad shape. The driver of the vehicle stayed and spoke with police. Uh, on Monday morning, police confirmed the victim was 55-year-old boxing legend. Whitaker's professional career spanned from 1984 to 2001, where he became a four-weight world champion. Yes. He won the gold at the 84 Olympics with, you know, Evander Holyfield. Who else was in that group? Um, Pernell Sweet Pea. Um, what's the other little dude's name? Oh, God. Look, thick guy. Kind of remind you of Kyle Lowry. Uh, anyway, I can't think of him right now. Oh, my goodness. I heard he's punchy drunk, though. Man, I am so sad. My heart goes out to his family. It's anyway, he won the gold in 1984 in the lightweight category. And after retiring... He was inducted into the Hall of Fame. Oh, my goodness. I'm sorry, y'all. Man, I'm sorry. Oh, God. He was in, anyway, he was inducted to the International Boxing Hall of Fame in 2006. Whitaker was born in Norfolk and made the Hamptons Road his home. Um... In 2014, he made national headlines after evicting his own mother from a home he purchased for her. Um, in a coincidence, his own brother was hit and injured by a car last year in Norfolk. Following Sunday's night incident, traffic on westbound was shut down for several hours but has since reopened. Pedestrian Noah Brown and many others crossed at the Northampton Boulevard and Baker Road. They all say it's, da it's a dangerous intersection. The light changes real fast. As soon as I get across the street, it suddenly changes, and you have to stop in the middle and wait for the traffic to go, and then you can go. Officers from the Department of Fatal Crash Incidents team are investigating. So far, police have not said that if a driver will face any charges. I think they need to get more, a little more timing before the lights change. And it needs to be a little longer. When you go up the street, they have like a sign that says walk. And you have like 20 seconds to get across one of those. But they need to do something with this. Oh, my God. Brown said the victim and his family are in his thoughts and prayers. I feel bad for whoever family that man was, Brown said.
Wow. Well, rest in peace, my brother. He was a boxing great. Rest in peace. Pernell Whitaker. What a way to go. All right, you guys. I'll see you in the next video.